Hey y'all, it's Will, the Deep Sky Dude. What a crazy thing just went down. Something hit the moon while the total lunar eclipse was going down. I got footage of it in 4K. You've probably seen the video. I'm gonna break down a little bit what we're looking at here and hopefully shed some light on some of this. So uh, this is the this is the equipment that I use, the Explorer Scientific ED-102 with the Sony A7S Mark II and an Orion Atlas EQ mount. I added everything in Final Cut Pro, and uh, that's what you're seeing here. This is what I get when I hook all that together and I videotape the moon, okay? So this is the image I get. Uh, I've got this looped over and over again, you know, just to go back and forth uh, to get better detail. And um, so what I can do here is uh, I can actually take an image of the moon, some video of the moon just after totality, or just after the umbra went off the moon, so there's no shadow on the moon, and I can put it on top of the video of the moon when the impact happened. I can drop the opacity, move stuff around. You can see I'm moving one under the other and kind of getting everything where I think it's lined up. And then my idea here was that I would be able to see the flash through the full undarkened moon to maybe get some more detail about where the location was and so that's what I've done here I've um, I've got it down pretty close it's not perfect but it's real close and you can see I'm going frame by frame here and you can really see where the the event took place there's a new crater down there I think that's the coolest thing ever people are like well how do craters form here you go this is how they form and we got to watch it um, as it happened basically in this particular process. Uh, I love it. This, this, this footage to me is incredible. I was at the right place at the right time. I'm so excited that, uh, that I was able to get this. But there you can see the flash. Um, I, I thought it was Lagrange G when I was first looking at it. Um, and this was before I made this particular overlay. Uh, I think the experts are saying Lagrange H. I'm not an expert here by any stretch of the imagination. I'm just a dude having fun with a telescope. And, um, you know, I think that we can contribute a lot to actual science, us amateurs, just out here having fun videotaping an eclipse, getting this amazing data. We can actually help actual science take place, which is really cool. Um, you can see just to the right of this little clearing, this little dark area, that's where this uh, this crater is going to be, and then so I've got my two clips. Basically, uh, what I can do is, you know, copy these and I can paste them and make a loop again. And so then I have just a loop of the explosion going down uh, one after the other. So then you can see it multiple times. It's not just flashing then it's gone and everybody's like, where did it was it? What happened? Whatever. You want to be able to see it multiple times so then you can get some some good detail. And then, of course, what I'll do is I'll take this, this final product, and I'll zoom in and I'll do some color correction to bring out some contrast here and there. And uh, so let's take a look at what that looks like right here. So here it is. Um, you can see the redness on the, of the, uh, the eclipsed moon underneath, the bright crispness of the full moon on top. You can see it's just a little shifted. I tried really hard to get it perfect but uh, could never get it exactly uh, right. Uh, you see 10% normal speed here. It's just a nice, long explosion. I mean, I got, I think, five frames, at least four uh, of good, different data in this one area. It's definitely there for four to five frames. Um, I'm not sure about the sixth frame, Maybe it's there in the sixth frame. Maybe there's a slight glow. Uh, I've got some friends of mine that are actual experts that are going to look at this stuff a little more in detail and hopefully let me know. But there it is. You can, you know, the further I zoom in, the worse the quality degrades. And that's just an artifact of, you know, how video and uh, all this stuff works. Um, but, you know, 10% normal speed, you can really see uh, this 
awesome explosion happen. I'm going to keep studying this. I know there's going to be uh, papers and all kinds of stuff written on this. So I'll try to report back on this as much as I can here and there. I just wanted to make a follow-up video to show you guys a little bit deeper into the explosion. I hope you all enjoyed it. I hope you all enjoyed the eclipse. And if you didn't, maybe you'll catch the next one. Lots of cool stuff coming up in 2019, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.